Uh, I honestly didn't really watch too much. Um, I watched maybe a couple games, but I was more so focused with my family. Um, you know, uh, games that I could, I could watch. And I noticed the guys fought. You know, man down. Um, just you know, little things. You know, that's it. But you know, just because you know I, I wasn't there, like you guys still was fighting, still was you know going out there competing the same, and you know it's just giving that you know that presence that I brought. Um, it just wasn't there at that moment. So I understood that you know, during that time I was, you know, it, it hurt some games to watch, you know, just because I was, you know, focused on, um, I couldn't be out there, but as a whole, you know, I know them guys, you know, was going to be able to hold it down. And you know, like I said, it was a, it was a tough stretch. It was a tough stretch for us. And, you know, for me, um, like I said, I wanted to go out there, but, you know, the family came, came for, come first. So, um, you know, it's, it felt good to get back. Uh, you know, I wish it would have been different circumstances, but we were one. Um, but just being out there back with the guys, you know, it felt really good. In terms of the struggles that the team has had, um, for you personally, how, how much uh, can you really do for that team getting back in two days? Uh, it's, it'll take a couple more games. Um, when you don't play for that long, you know, you can't get out of rhythm a little bit. But, you know, the main thing is my conditioning didn't really drop. Um, and that's the hardest part about, you know, not doing nothing for a week is the conditioning factor. So that didn't really drop off. But, you know, like I said, getting getting back into the flow of it, you know, it, it just comes with uh, being back out there. So as you get a feel for the game and, you know, keep playing, you know, like I said, just getting the rhythm that way. As a veteran coach, you've played with Coach Eagle many times. What's the most important thing for a team to do in the last month of the season to kind of get that blitz system struck? Just focus on habits. Um, doing the right thing and just focus on habits. Um, you know, you never know where you're gonna end up or who is gonna be the matchup. So it's just about building positive habits, bringing going into it. Um, uh, tonight, you know, they they rebounded the ball well. They made a lot of made a lot of shots. Um, physicality hurt us a lot, and you know, it's just a uh, like I said, the rebound aspect is kind of what hurt us, and you know, getting out, giving up uh, threes. But like I said, it's it's about just building little habits. Um, we'll be able to bounce back. You know, we'll go home and bounce back, recover. And, you know, like I said, we'll sit down and watch them and, you know, get back to the driveway and ready for the next game. Just talk to the um, point of attack defense that Ty talked about and the rebounding, which has been kind of lingering issues at times this year. But what other great habits do you feel like you guys have to have to keep building on? Um, just got to keep, you know, the effort. Um, we do a great job of, you know, first and second effort, just as plays break down, just keep on, um, you know, finishing our plays. That's the main thing is the offensive rebound that we gave, we gave up uh, tonight, you know, really, really, really hurt us. Um, but those things, like, we'll be able to key into more, like, if we practice and, you know, understand, like, the matchups of who we go. And like I said, in the playoffs, there's a difference. You know, it's a different model tonight. It's a different dynamic, different approach. So, you know, as we go, we'll focus in, finish out the season as strong as possible, and you know, get ready for the next step. Talk about it a little bit there for a second, but what do you feel like collectively made it so difficult to defend against them tonight, especially towards the end of the first half? We gave them that. Defense. They made a lot of shots. Um, they got out. We didn't make shots. Um, their defense, you know, really amped up. Uh, they created a lot of steals. Uh, created a lot of you know fast break possessions. They had um, how many? I can't even remember how many points in the paint. But when, uh, yeah, yeah, fifty six points in the paint. You know, score one twenty one. That's you know hard. So dude, they was getting to the paint very, and it, that caused us to be in you know rotations. Um, so when they was close driving and kicking, you know, that was leading to open shots and guys knocked down a lot of good shots. So you know just. You know, not breaking down on the, on the drives and allowing paint touches. You know, that's the main thing that really hurt us this game. Thank you. Thank you, Vince.